This is Randy Thompson coming to you live with Trudy Adams and we're working on the steps to connection and we've really breaking them apart. As you're walking, you can you can do a 20 meter circle around me. I know we don't do a lot of circles. Yeah, no, I understand because we're going to do what? Walk, talk, walk, um, halt? Yeah, but first we're going to make sure at the walk, like you feel right now. She's thrown her head up. That's right. So the steps to connection on the left side, is she giving you her jaw? Yes, no, or maybe? Maybe. Okay, so first you have to give her to give you her jaw at the walk on the left side. Oh good. And then you're going to play on the left side, right side. Will she unlock? Can you feel her give you her jaw on the right side? Praise her. Okay, now we're going to play with the pole. For sister's jaw, then we're going to step 2 is the pole. Okay? Get her to loosen her pole so that her throat latch opens up. As she stays soft on the jaw. Good, good. Okay, now make sure you, that's all right. Soften her jaw, soften her pole. Now you're gonna add the rainbow. So you might have to, to get the rainbow, shorten the length of your outside rain a little bit. There, feel her coming different under your seat? So by feeling where her neck is, you're actually feeling when she picks you up under the seat, aren't you? So you're gonna add just the three steps that we're gonna add, cause it all adds up, you know, ends up with your legs and stuff. But first we're gonna do soften to the jaw. Step one, soft to soften to the pole. Step two, step three will be the rainbow in the neck because that tells you she's under your seat. Good, soften her jaw, soften her pole. There, here, feel her picking you up different? You should be able to look between her ears to know if you've got her head in the right place. Most people will bring their horse's head too far to the inside where they can't see between the ears and that's when they're just turning the, turning the neck and head instead of bringing the horse's shoulders over. Okay, now you're gonna prepare for a halt doing this. So check on your inside, outside rein and leg first. Is she soft? Check her jaw, check her pole, check her on the outside rein. Now and she's soft. Good, now she's ready to slow down the steps of the walk until she halts. Keep her soft in her jaw, her pole, and her neck. Oh, she even had a little purr with that. Did you feel that? We're not going to worry about straightness right now because first we just had, did you feel how nice and relaxed that was? I did. Okay, now before you walk, notice she's uphill too. Yeah. Before you walk, she has to do the steps to connection. Soften the jaw, soften the pole, take your time. That's it. Do you feel her picking you up? Right. Now get her to step up with her back feet first. Keep her soft. That's it. Feel her, feel where she locks up a little. That's where she should be doing. That's where, because she's just learning how to connect. This is her eighth or ninth time to where we've asked her to stay on contact. So we expect her to unlock. You're just feeling where you can help her with the steps to connection to stay soft. Is it kind of like they are balanced a little bit too, where they'll throw that head out for balance to some degree? Well, some of it's just they're not used to, for her, it's you, her not used to you telling her where to be in her balance. And she's not being bad. She's like, okay, let me go back to being a green horse on a long rein. Take your time. Soften her more. Soften her more. Sit, sit, sit. Praise her. Again, we don't care if it's square at this point. Okay, now soften her before you walk. Check the steps. It's all right. You have to get her attention. Look between her ears. Very nice. Do you feel the difference? That's, so what you did was exactly right. Most riders, they might get the first step and then they drop. Notice I said most riders, they drop the connection the second and third step after. Yeah. That's the way it is. So you've got to be able to keep her on the steps to connection all the time. Like right there, do the yeah. steps of connection. This time you're going to halt in a different place. Change, change directions, yes. And always halt in a different place. Okay, check her. Check the steps to connection. Step one. Praise her. Step two, check her pole, praise her. And remember, every time you use your rein as you're walking, you're gonna add a little leg. That's good, good. And she's trying to poke her nose out. She's not trying, she, Trudy said she's poking her nose out. She's not trying to poke her nose out. She doesn't know where it should be. Well, I mean, I'm just telling you what I'm feeling. Oh, good, good, okay. So you feel that she's disconnecting. Good, now keep her connected, keep her connected, keep her connected, keep, praise her. Good, now you've got to open her throat latch, so pick her nose up. 
Soften her jaw upwards. Pick her up so her pole gets loose and she picks you up. Good, good, good. Good. Higher, higher. Okay, higher with the neck. Higher with the pole. Keep the pole the highest point. Keep the pole up. That's right. Keep the pole up and everything. There you go. Keep the pole up. It's all right. It's all right. Good. Yes, yes, that, and that's exactly right because it takes nine, you know, a thousand times for. Very nice. Keep her pole up. Keep her pole up. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Get her pole up. Yeah, I don't know why she wants to. In this direction, she's trying to drop her legs. Pick her pole up with your outside rein and leg. She's trying to figure out how to stay connected. It's only the eighth or ninth time we've asked her to stay on contact, so she really doesn't know. So she's like, well, if you're going to have that feeling in my mouth, I'll just stick my chest, my nose on my chest because it almost feels like that's there. Do you feel her coming through her back that time? Well, she did at the end, but look at the balance she stopped in. I know. I can hear it. I can hear it. Good. Now, this time when you come to a halt, remember to do a slight shoulder four. So especially pull up, pull up with a shoulder four. So you can see between her ears, the point of her chest. Every time her pole stop, drops, you're going to do a shoulder four to get her pole up and to position her neck and head in the right place. Good. A shoulder four into a halt. Keep her pole up with your outside rein. Very good. Keep her pole up. That's it. She's just trying to figure it out. Good, good. That's all right. We don't care. She said she's still rooting a little bit. Good girl. There. She stayed under you different. So what rain is that? Outside. Yep, very good. She said the outside. That's exactly right. With your outside leg. Remember, you use the two together. That's right. If she steps to the side, you need more outside leg. That was nice. You feel her picking you up under the saddle? Yeah. At least she didn't throw her head up. I know she did. That's right. Pull up. Pull up. Good. Okay, let's let her have a... We're going to go into a stretchy walk to give her a break. Keep on the feel of the reins, and we're just going to let her take a walk break now. That was good, Trudy. What are you feeling with the steps of the connection now? Let me get up to you so people can hear you. I don't think they can hear me. I don't know. Not unless I come up here. All steps right. Of, all right. I am feeling the steps of connection. It's I have got to slow down and do it piece by piece instead of trying to get it all in one swoop. That's right. And I tend to do that. Most riders do. But I do feel or try in this direction. It's a different problem than the right. other direction. Exactly. But I know that's not uncommon for horses either. That's right. Other direction, she wants to throw her head up at the halt. And in this direction, she wants to drop her head down too far, too low. But I'm just using the outside rein to try to keep it up. And that's right. It's almost like playing the piano. It is. Tinkle, tinkle, tinkle. It is. It is. That was very nice. Okay, let's give her a little walk break. That was good, Trudy. Can she have Thank a you. cookie?